Namaste. Okay, today I am discuss. I am going to discuss about uh, emotional intelligence. Yeah, it is very important uh, quality of human resources. Yeah, emotional intelligence uh, is 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 a very very important uh, characteristics of human resources. So simply, it is uh, written by Daniel Goleman, and this is very important in present context. So emotional intelligence is the ability to identify and regulate one's emotion and understand the emotions of others. Yeah. Especially this emotional intelligence is the understand and regulate our intelligence, our emotion, our perception, and understanding the emotion of different other people who are concerned to, to we people, we as a manager, we leader as well. A high emotional intelligence helps to build a relationship, reduce team stress, and diffuse conflict and improve job satisfaction. Yeah, there are so many uh, very good characteristics uh, under this emotional intelligence. Basically, it helps to build a better relationship among or between different stakeholders, and it reduces uh, the different states of different people. It uh, resolve our uh, solution of the conflict यदि हमें विभिन्न ह्यूमन रिसोर्सेस बेस में कन्फ्लिक्ट रेज भि इमोशनल इंटेलिजेन्स क्यारेटिस्टिक्स इट इट डिफ्यूज एंड इट इम्प्रूव गुड रिलेशनशिप एंड इम्प्रूव जब सैटिस्फैक्शन बिट्विन अमंग डिफ्रेंट ह्यूमन रिसोर्सेस इमोशनल इंटेलिजेन्स इज द एबिलिटी टू अंडरस्टैंड एंड मैनेज युअर वन इमोशन as well as the emotion of others. Uh, uh, emotional intelligence is just as important for success in our life as uh, IQ and perhaps even more so on. So uh, this emotional intelligence is a very important characteristics and it consists of different uh, sub skills and basically Emotional intelligence consists of five very key skills of uh, different human resources. Self-awareness, self-regulation, motivation, empathy, social skills. Yeah, these characteristics, these skills must be concerned to this uh, emotional intelligence. If you are emotionally intelligent, त्यो मंचे में यो विभिन्न कैटिस्टिक्स और विभिन्न स्किल्स और उन्हें पर सा सेल्फ अवेयरनेस वाव बने व्हाट इज़ राइट एंड व्हाट इज़ रॉंग बनने को ही ऑटोमेटिकली डिसाइडेड एंड सेल्फ रेगुलेशन मेंस ही और सी इम्सेल्फ रेगुलेटेड मोटिवेशन इस द इम्पोर्टेंट कैटिस्टिक्स ये मतलब यो काम करने पर बिजनेस इम्पैथी बट नॉट सिम्पैथी इम्पैथी वाले को मंचेलाई सहानुभूति संगसंगे वे हैव टू टू शेयर द डिफरेंट रिसोर्सेस एस वेल एंड सोशियल स्किल्स वाले को इट बिल्ड द रिलेशनशिप बिटवीन अमाउंट डिफरेंट सोसाइटी का फिनोमिनारु पब्लिक संगपनी एले राम रिलेशन मेंटेन कर सा वाले को सो इमोशनल yeah, it is ongoing process. Because I mean, I mean, that practically we have to implement over the time, over over different to our duty and responsibilities. I mean, say, task gun saxon, use gun saxon. Emotional intelligence can help you success in all areas of your life, including your personal relationship, your career, and your health. Yeah, health or career is important. Right, emotionally intelligence characteristics sabani. I mean, we we automatically we build off our career and uh, our health chai pani ramro uncha bani kuro chai le explain garcha. Emotional intelligence can helps to make better decisions where you are aware of your one emotion and the emotion of different other people's concerned party concerned people. <clears throat> yeah, you are better able to weigh all of the factors involved in decision making yes if we, we we have this type of quality 
automatically different factors we consider when we can uh, make a decision about different things. And if we make a plan and policies about different things, then we can use different uh, say, to, say, skill, family, within the factor analysis, this will be a better relation, better decision, better plan, better policies as well. <clears throat> Yeah, it can help you to resolve conflict more effectively. In the case, any relationship between um, between among different stakeholders, automatically, any such conflict resolution garna sajilo garsa. And when you can understand and empathize uh, with the other person's pr perspective, you are more likely to find the solution that works for everyone. Yeah, if we, we have empathized quality, sympathize, empathy, if we can understand the emotion, understand the perception, understand the psychology of different workers, then automatically we can resolve different types of conflict when it arises over there. Then it can help you to build a stronger relationship when you can able to communicate your one emotion clearly and understand the emotion of others. We are more likely to build trust and intimacy. Yeah, if we build the trust and intimacy among different stakeholders, different workers, different staffs, different coordinates, then automatically I mean, let's say relationship build up conflict solution anxiety manage Yeah, it can help you to manage stress and anxiety. Yeah, finally, it is, it is important to, to, it can lead to better physical health as well. So, emotional intelligence is the most important characteristics, most important assets of human resources. So, uh, it is it is the very, very important for all level of human resources. And once again, uh, like and subscribe my YouTube channel and listen this uh, important part of uh, emotional intelligence. Thank you very much. Thank you.